how to be participate in the poll of the day. It's on my Twitter account. Follow me at Barcelo Philly. But I'm going to play this clip. This has gone viral. If you haven't seen this already, well, I'm, you're welcome. Uh, this right here is Noah Lyles. He is a track star for the United States. Um, and he has a uh, is an important message to all of our basketball fans here in America, especially the ones who watch the National Basketball Association. So without further ado, just take a look, and then we'll bring up the poll of the day. Noah Lyles. World champion of what? The United States? You know, the thing that hurts me the most is that I have to watch the NBA Finals and they have world champion on their head. World champion of what? The United States? Don't get me wrong. I, I love the U.S. at times. <laughs> but that ain't the world. That is not the world. We are the world. We have almost every country out here fighting, thriving, putting on their flag to show that they are represented. There ain't no flags in the NBA. <laughs> World champion of what? All right. So that is Noah Lyles. Um, I'm a, I, I've been trying to look all day for what the reasoning of this is. Um, and I guess it's the World Athletics Championship in Budapest. So I'm not familiar with the track world. Obviously, we have the Penn Relays. That's about the extent of my knowledge of how these competitions do work. But. Noah Lyles obviously is going on a little bit of a tangent. Does sound like a little bit random as well, but here's the thing, right? So what Noah Lyles is saying is because of the fact that the NBA clearly represents the United States and one single team in Canada. So let's just put it this way. The NBA represents North America. If you want to throw Mexico in there, whatever. But at the end of the day, the NBA represents United States and Canada. So his logic is that because they play only in North America, only in, predominantly in the United States, that putting world champion next to, which at this point right now, it's the Denver Nuggets who just won the NBA championship. The Denver Nuggets should not be deemed the world champion because of the fact they play in the NBA that is only for North American teams, again, predominantly the United States. So that is the topic of today, and this is where I will bring in, this is the perfect segue here for our poll of the day. Again, you guys are more than welcome to vote here. It is on my Twitter account, at Barcelo Philly, and the question today is, is the NBA champ the world champion? And I'll repeat again. Is the NBA champion the world champion? Right now, over on my Twitter account, we have 27 votes just started. But leading the way with 66.7% of the votes is no. The NBA champ is not the world champion. Yes, this has 33.3%. But people have spoken so far. And so far, it is no, they are not the world champion. Here's my thought. Here is my take, okay? The NBA is by far the best league in the world. There are other leagues, and there are some solid leagues around the world. The NBA has the best talent. The NBA has the best international talent. You look at some of the best players in the league right now. You have Luka Doncic from Slovenia. You have the current uh, NBA NBA, NBA, N, sorry, NBA Finals MVP, can't speak there, uh, Nikola Jokic, who is technically from Bosnia, but he represents Serbia, whatever, it's a different topic for a different day, um, Joel Embiid, representing Cameroon, France, whatever, Rudy, Rudy Gobert, not one of the best in the league, but representing France, so many players from so many different countries now, a league is 100% more international than it was before, okay? But the fact of the matter is, just because Joel Embiid is from Cameroon doesn't mean he's representing Cameroon in the NBA. He is, but not real, not in high, not legitimately, if that's what I'm trying to say. He represents Philadelphia. He represents the 76ers. Okay, It's not a country that's a city in the United States. I'm going to have to agree with, 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 with Noah Lyles here. At the end of the day, the NBA is the best league. But until we can get some type of Champions League of basketball where you get the NBA, 
the Spanish league, the British, I don't know if the British league has a league, give the best leagues in the world to play in this tournament, then no, the NBA champ is not the champion of the world. The NBA champ is the champ of the NBA. And we understand that that is the best league in the world, but it's still not. The Premier League is the perfect example. Everyone, no one debates the Premier League is the best league in the world. But do you think last year or the past couple years when Manchester City won the Premier League, you think Manchester City were deemed the world champions? No, they were not. They were not deemed the world champions. Who won? Who won Champions League last year? Don't don't fucking tell me who won Champions. League. Wasn't it Inter Milan? Did not Inter Milan win Champions League? Whatever. That's the champion of the world, or I guess they're not technically the champions of the world. But whoever wins the League World Cup, the Club World Cup, who I think Real Madrid won last year, that is a champion of the world. But Champions League, if you win the Champions League, you're pretty much. And, th and that's not the same as the NBA because you're talking about Europe as a continent. A continent that's strictly dominated the sport. All the best players do play there. But if we're sticking with our argument here, then the, the winner of the League's World Cup, the FIFA Club World Cup, is the champion of the world. So I would have to agree with Noah Lyles. I understand that there is a little bit of marketing behind that as well. Uh, when you do say you are the world champion, it's the same thing with the Super Bowl. That's even funnier because realistically, how many teams, or I'm sorry, how many countries actually play American football? I, I can tell you that I, there's probably less than a handful of countries that actually play and participate in American football. So it is an interesting topic. You guys can throw your 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 opinions in there, but I'm gonna have to agree with Noah Lyles. I don't think that the NBA champion should be the champion of the, champion of the world. 